All of it is around every day. Around nine people die in a distracted driving accident. That frightening statistic from the CDC. Now one mother is hoping her story of tragedy will help save local lives. CBS 42's Hillary Simon live tonight with a message one mom is sharing along the same interstate where she lost her daughter, Hillary. Yeah, Jack, we've done stories before about Cece Calloway from Alabaster that died while texting and driving last year. Her mother, Michelle, says they soon will have a billboard near I-65 in Green Springs Highway with her daughter's face. And she hopes people will get the message and put that phone down. It's easy to find distracted drivers on the interstate, but Michelle Lunsford is hoping this message will make them think twice. I know I've reached a lot of people, but this billboard... 100,000 people a week will pass by and see it. So we're talking in the three month period, it'll be up 1.2 million people. Uh, I, that to me is even more so impactful. Lunsford says the timing of this billboard commemorates a lot of significant dates. It's going to be up Monday, January 21st through April the 14th, which will. Uh, she passed away February 22nd. It will honor that day, her birthday in March, and also the hands free bill that's going to be in Montgomery the second week of March. Meanwhile, Talladega County, Childersburg High School is sending a message about distracted driving, too. The other day, they were making a short film for the Safe Rides, Safe Lives contest. Uh, it was graphic, but it brought up an awareness, and I'm just praying that this. This video will help save the lives of other students. Principal Dr. Quentin Lee says this short clip shows students going to prom and dying in a distracted driving accident. He says first responders helped to make it feel more real, and it did. Just hearing the kids yell or their friends and their friends weren't, wasn't responding, just very emotional, and it just brought it real. Whether it's through a short clip or a billboard, different groups are trying to get the word out. You know, one person leaving this earth affects so many people and what I think it's so sad because it was preventable. Now now we've done stories before about CC Callaway. Now that billboard is expected to go up Monday, January 21st and be up for three months. She says she hopes senators and legislators pass this as they head to Montgomery and hopefully vote for the hands free bill that'll ban holding your phone while driving just like in Georgia. Hillary Simon, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.